Hey and welcome to Not Only Hollywood. Today I'm going to review Blue from 2021. This is a Japanese sports drama. We follow three boxers. One of them is a solid boxer who is going to fight for the title, but his brain has taken some serious damage after all the punches he has received throughout his career. The second boxer is a boxer who never wins, but he can be a brilliant coach if he walks down that path. The third boxer is a rookie who is a real wimp. Blue is an interesting sports movie about three people who live ordinary lives. But they love boxing, especially the two veterans. But there comes a time when the punches they have taken throughout their career begin to show. And it seems like both of the two veterans boxing careers are on life support. It's time to quit. What I liked about this movie is that it feels realistic. We spend a lot of time in the boxing gym with the central characters. They feel just like three average people. So Blue is a movie with normal characters that love boxing. But some of them lack the talent and courage to take the next step. And for some of them, it's too late. We see them train and bond, and we know that for some of them, their boxing journey is soon over. The reason I wanted to watch this movie was because of Kenichi Matsuyama. He was one of my favorite Japanese actors in the 2000s, and you should recognize him from the Death Note movies, where he played L. He was one of the best young actors in Japan. He picked out some strange and also some mature roles for his age. He is so good in drama movies and especially in playing an average character. The boxing matches are uneven. The boxing matches look a little fake and weak. But they don't do that much damage since the storytelling and the character's journey are interesting. If you like sports movies and boxing, then Blue is a movie worth watching, where we follow some average Joes trying to become as good as possible in the sport they love so much. From 1 to 10, I give Blue a 7 out of 10. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Sleep well and dream about me.